Okay, so your business is unique to you, and so is how you probably want to use your CRM. The very first thing you probably want to customize is your sales pipeline. Here you can add new pipeline, name it, choose your color, and fill in your sales stage names and percentage probabilities of closure. As you can see, I have more than one pipeline, and you can too. So I will pick the one I want to edit, and then I can edit each of my stages. Name, closure probability, or set how long an opportunity should stay in a given stage by enabling velocity and filling in the number of days. Here I can add a new sales stage and choose where I want it to be located in the pipeline. Here you can help your salespeople stay focused by defining the sales activities they need to do next. Let's say your rep needs to send a confirmation email first in order to move forward. Or they might need to arrange a meeting and confirm that the prospect has watched the product video you sent. Sales activities allow you to define how your salespeople should operate. Once you set them up, they are located in Opportunities Details. And the gamified view rewards reps with visual progress status, now instant gratification for the salesperson. You can also attach documents specific to each stage here, like invoice templates, mail templates or demo presentations. This can be done right from the pipeline. You can create custom product lists with pricing, so that you just enter what your prospect is looking to buy and see. Another thing you'll find very useful in Pipeliner are common lists. Here you specify your account industries. Perhaps you're in a very specific niche where you don't need that many categories. Say only 5 or 10, see, no problem. Add your own activity types like send email with the appropriate icon. Feel free to switch from task type activity to appointment type activity. Create your own account types. Maybe you want to add premium so that you know that this account deserves special attention. Or maybe set up the scale to be from small companies to large companies instead of new and existing customers. Then, based on your own experiences, you can set up your own list of lost reasons. Maybe you never lose on price, but sometimes you lose on not having a particular feature. And of course, sales roles. You can set up who's who in the company and how they're going to influence a sale, like a decision maker, an influencer maybe, or a naysayer. You can name the roles yourself, based on the type of buyers you encounter in your sales cycles. See, Pipeliner CRM, it's not our CRM, it really is yours. Go ahead and click this button and start your own trial. Or click on one of these and learn how Pipeliner can help you with other tasks.